All right, Richard, here's the scenario. Talk to me, man. You got a whole horde of zombies heading your way. Uh-huh. Okay. And you got to pick a gun to take them all out. Okay. So, y'all already know I carry my Kinnick Mete MC9. But in that scenario, why would I not just pick my Glock 19X with the G-Flex trigger? Oh, you got a G-Flex trigger. Yeah. And this is the reason why. Welcome to Trigger Easily. Welcome back to the channel, guys. My name is Alex. And I'm Richard. And this is your favorite pro amateur channel. You already know. First and foremost, before we start the video, we're going to give our three shout outs. Number one, stay with me. We, I'm a Rootube. Shout out to We, I'm a Rootube. Your comment was picked. Also, we got Mr. Pinball Rick 6031. Some really good comments from yeah, him. Long, he long he, he, he form sent too. us a yeah. long comment. <laughs> and then, uh, of course, how can we forget my boy Dress to Kill Tay? He's been he's been binging our videos, bro. Yep, yep. He's been hitting us up and everything. Heck yeah. Hey, shout out to you, man. Shout out to all y'all. Of course, if you want to be shouted out in our video, just comment. We look at all of our comments. There's two of us. There's no comment that goes missed. We reply to all of our comments as well, as long as it's not super left or something you can't reply to, of course. Right. But let's get straight into this video, man. What yeah. We got today. We got something different for you guys today. We got the G Flex trigger. Yes, sir, we do. Now, if you guys don't know what a G Flex trigger is, first and foremost, this one is from PerformanceTriggers.com. Um, it's a binary trigger. Yep. Do you know what a binary trigger is? It was, it was when you pull it and it fires, and you let it go, it fires. Okay, okay, no, no. I thought I thought a binary trigger was basically meaning that it goes by both sexes, uh, whether male or female, and it doesn't get offended. I think you're talking about a binary person. Got you, got you, got you. Okay, guys, sorry about that. So yes, a binary trigger is basically when, as you guys know, I got a empty Glock 19 right here. This is actually what it's gonna go in. So of course, when you pull the trigger back, it lets off a round, and then you have to reset it, and then shoot again for it to go again. But so, so yeah, one fire, so one action, pull back, mm -hmm. one action, let go fully legal because it's one action per shot. Right. All right, we're gonna open it up right here on camera. See what's inside. I'm imagining just the trigger because it's not a very big package. <laughs> <laughs> it might not be too excited for you guys. <laughs> yes sir. That's it right there. I'm so ready to get this trigger off this Glock. Yeah, Glocks don't come with the best trigger anyway, so anything's probably an upgrade and I bet this thing's gonna be Pretty cool. Oh crap. Look at that. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. Look at that, guys. You install it right to the gun just like that, and there's nothing else in the bag. You got a little baggie, and then a little baggie. We can keep these later for uh, put stuff in, you know? And put our other trigger in. Yeah, old trigger. Yeah. All right, y'all. So, we also don't know how to install this thing in our Glock. So, what we're going to do, sorry for flagging, y'all. But we are going to make an installation video that's going to be separate from this. And we're also going to do a whole bunch of YouTube searching and stuff and uh, do it ourselves. So when you see us next, we will have the trigger in the Glock. Be right back. And we are back. We just installed it. I don't know if I'm posting the install video before or after this. But we just installed the trigger and we are back. Unloaded. Unloaded. So let's go ahead and show y'all how this bad boy works now. It actually wasn't hard, y'all. We looked up a video and it was super easy. So now, as you can see, of course, we clear it, guys. No mag in. So as you can see, first pull, that's a shot. Reset, that's Boom. another shot. Two shots, it's crazy. So once again, pull, that. pull the trigger, shot. shot. Let it go. That's another shot. You mean Two shot Glock. One thing I want to say is, it kind of, it's kind of a really heavy, heavy first pull. It really feels like a double single action on the first pull where you have the hammer down and you pull yeah. all the way back. Right. So really heavy, but I'm glad we got it installed because uh, y'all already know it's time to get to the range. So Let's hope y'all enjoyed the office part, but. We're going straight to the range. Let's do it. All right, y'all. Just like we said, we are right back here at the range. 
with the Glock and the B trigger. As you can hear, there's gonna be other gunshots in the background because we got people next to us. It's but, a busy day at the range. Yes, sir. But as y'all can see in the background, we got our target out and we got the Texas Star in the back. See, most people when they install their G Flex triggers, only thing they do is mad dump. Which we are gonna do. Don't get me wrong, we definitely are gonna do that. But we want to actually test out the accuracy of the G Flex trigger. So we're gonna start off, probably be about five to ten yards out. See what it looks like. We're gonna get some slow mos of the actual trigger, the function of it, so y'all can see how it looks. And then we're gonna have a little friendly competition to see who can knock down the Texas Star in the least amount of bullets. So let's get straight into it. Straight into it. All right, y'all. Of course, we started with Mr. Alex. Got the G Flex triggers. How many? How many bullets you gonna put to it, man? I don't know. I mean, I got a full mag loaded up, so we might as well see. I'm gonna go nice and slow. Mm -hmm to start out on we'll see how it goes from there but um wearing some gloves just because it's a little bit cold out here and this is the first time we're pulling the trigger on this thing so if it blows up <laughs> <laughs> gotta insert the mag see it that is shocking I do not like <laughs> Is that clear? Clear now. There was no jams or anything like that. And um it's definitely something to get used to because as soon as you let up the trigger, it fires. There's like no pull up. This just pop, pop. <laughs> so, uh, all right. So my shots were a little bit all over the place. So I was <laughs> aiming here. And honestly, the first pull was so heavy. I shot somewhere like down here. Um, and then every single time, the first couple times I shot here, I hit them up here uh, when I released the trigger because it's just... I gotta train my brain to think, all right, I'm letting this go, it's gonna fire again. Yeah. It's definitely uh, interesting to see that all over the place, but uh, let's see how Richard does. As y'all can see, that head's kinda naked, so y'all know I'm gonna go ahead and take that thing out easily. Trust me, all three targets. Triggered easily. Triggered easily. <laughs> <laughs> let's do it. All right, y'all, so I got the G Flex trigger, of course, already inside the Glock 19X. And uh, we're going to be shooting at the headshot today. And uh, first time shooting it, so I'm going to take it nice and slow. We'll get into the mag dumps later. But uh, let's see how accurate this thing is. Oh, snap. Dude, this is a super heavy trigger. Super heavy. Super heavy. Hold on. Too high. Where are these bullets going, bro? They're going over. Slowly. Really? I should have just shot the last bullet. Um, dude, I don't know what that was. This thing was super inaccurate. <laughs> super, super inaccurate. Dude. Holy crap. So I'm not gonna lie y'all, I don't know where the bullets went. So I was initially focused on that first trigger pull. When I first tried to shoot it, the trigger is so heavy. Um, Dude, I don't know what's my shots or not. Like, do you know, do you remember which one's of my shots? Um, Yeah, mine, mine were more over to the uh, left-hand side. Yours is definitely more over to the right-hand side. I want y'all to know I was aiming here like the whole time. And then I started aiming down here when I heard I was shooting too high. Um, man, dude, this Texas start thing is gonna be crazy, bro. Um, you ready to get some mag dumpster, bro? Yeah, definitely. Let's get some mag dumpster. I think that's what this gun is for. <laughs> All right, guys, this is what you really came to see. A mag dump with the G Flex, so binary trigger. Y'all ready? Yeah. 
That's a full mag. Let's take a look at the let's take a look at the target. Alright. Let's look at that. I don't know if y'all remember, but there was nothing on the head shots. Now all of a sudden, look at the head. <laughs> so it's accuracy, it's really accuracy by uh volume. So the more bullets you can dump out, the more accurate you are, naturally. <laughs> Let's see how Richard does. Perfect. All right, Richard, here's the scenario. Talk to me, man. You got a whole horde of zombies heading your way. Uh-huh. Okay. And you got to pick a gun to take them all out. Okay. So, y'all already know I carry my Kinnick Mete MC9. But in that scenario, why would I not just pick my Glock 19X with the G-Flex trigger? Oh, you got a G-Flex trigger. Yeah. And this is the reason why. All clear. Just like that, baby. <laughs> what the freak? All right, Alex. It's Texas start time, man. That's right. Hey, let's be honest. How 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 many how many bullets do you think it's gonna take for you to knock down this Texas start with the binary trigger? I only load what I need, and I loaded 19. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of bullets, man. <laughs> but uh, we'll see. You know, you never know. I feel you, man. Could be better. Uh, could be better or worse, I think. Right. We'll take it nice and slow, as slow as you can with one of these triggers. <laughs> All right. You ready? Let's do it. Oh! 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 Hey! Holy crap! Is that like the best run ever? Wow. Wait, that was actually really good. So, uh, you got like all your bullets almost. I, I got one, like, because it shot twice, I got one and then the other one. Hey, that's perfect. That was probably less than 10 rounds. That's lit. Nah, that's more than 10 rounds, right? Every shot. I pressed it like five oh, times. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, so, uh, let's see how Richard does. Richard, what are you doing? Oh, just getting ready for the worst performance ever? Why do you think that? Bro, there's no way you can do it, what you just did on that last round, bro. Listen, it's really good. You just gotta take it slow. I'm not gonna lie, you, you set the bar high, man. Uh, but, let's see what I got. Let's see what I got. Come on, I got this. I believe in myself. Woo! Oh, I got a jam, bro. Back in action. Take it slow. Oh, wait, I got one more bullet. <laughs> I got another. Oh, what do you do then? <laughs> oh, man. Well, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, but it still wasn't as good. But yeah. All right, y'all. I know that was a nice, nice and short video. I think it was short. I don't really know how long we've been talking in front of the camera or anything. Yeah, I don't think it was that long of a video. Yeah, but that was the that was the performance trigger, the yeah. the G Flex trigger, binary shooting on a, a Glock. The first time, actually, a really funny experience. It was really fun. Yeah, when I first shot it, I didn't know what to expect. Yeah. Um, it wasn't exactly perfect, right? But as you can see, you can actually make it pretty accurate. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Star. The Texas Star. I thought we were gonna miss every bullet. That Texas Star performance. Hey, I got hope it, for it. And when you release, it's actually a really flat shot because mm -hmm. there's no pull down. There's nothing like that. It yep. actually, in my opinion, it improved the Glock yep. by, by a ton. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I, I feel him on that. Um, now don't get me wrong y'all, we're gonna come out here and do another video. I wanna do a full steel plate run. You know we got the horizontal plates where it has like six of them. I wanna try to knock that down. I wanna try to knock down the regular bodies and the Texas Star. I like to do a run and actually challenge Alex to the G-Flex trigger challenge. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm down. As you guys seen, that, that Texas Star was nothing with it. Yeah, I was about to say, I thought he thought he was gonna beat me. <laughs> y'all already know Team Richard in the chat. I'm gonna win that. But thank y'all for watching it and making it to the end. Hopefully you did. If you want your own performance trigger, go down in the link in the description and get you one. Yeah, definitely pick one up, uh, pick one up guys, because uh, it's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. It's, it's, it's an awesome experience. 
now don't conceal don't don't use it for concealed carrying or anything it's it's, it's really fun for range yeah as you've range seen, purposes the only the only big issue with this is at, like your last shot yeah you had another trigger you had yeah, to release I, it i was done i was done shooting but i had another bullet i had to release it you can't just <laughs> you can't just stop right there you know what i mean so yeah definitely but. fun thank you for performance triggers for sending us that trigger definitely enjoyed the experience and we're definitely gonna bring it back out here and do it again heck yeah, yeah. we'll get, catch you guys on the next one triggered, triggered easily, easily. Mag up that subscribe button. button.